I'm Danielle from Pro World. I'm Gianna. And my husband's behind the camera today. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> all right. Well, I hope you all are doing well. Please make sure you chime in. Let us know uh, where you're from, how you're doing, and you're moving everything around. Okay. I'm so sorry. So. Um, like many of you, we have been sitting in our home for quite some time now, a few weeks, and, you know, looking around, you kind of think, what can I decorate? So, uh, we decided that, are you going to hold up? To use this and turn it into this. Yes. So, we might as well decorate some light switch wall plates. And how we do that with is with sign vinyl. So we have our Caesar uh, Easy PSV Sign Vinyl. We have it in glitter. And we also have um, in the rose gold. And I think that's it. So we are going to be using yes. glitter and rose gold. All right. So we're going to show you just how easy it is. We're doing mine first. No, we're going to do this one first. <laughs> <laughs> so this is basically I put my... Caesar sign vinyl onto my um, cameo. Gosh, what do they call this? Um, mat. There you go, a cameo mat. And it cut out my design. And I'm just going to. Can you stop moving all those around? I'm making lots of noise. That one's going on this, right? Yeah. And I'm just going to weed away my excess, and I'm just going to do it right here on my mat. Um, because there's no reason to try and pull it off my mat, I'll do that later. So I'm just gonna kind of peel that through. And a, one of our customers gave us this great idea to use a lint roller to put all your remains on it with your excess. Dog first, so. It doesn't work for, for our dog, uh, but it, it does work for others. Um, so I'm just going to use that there. That was a great tip uh, that she gave. Whoops. Instead of, because I was hooking it onto my finger, which then you have to, you know, remove everything. So I thought that was a perfect tip. All right. Do we have any, any questions while we get started? That's it. Okay. And you're just going to go through and weed all your excess away, the things that you don't want. Just remove that. Hey, we got Georgia checking in. Hello. And we have some already cut designs. Oh, that was a piece that needed to stay. Um, we have some already cut designs over there, so... We will, uh, once these are finished through, then we'll um, go ahead to those and kind of make all different ones for you. Hi, from Vegas. Weeding is very, very tedious. Yes, I weeded most of them um, just because this is so tedious. But to kind of show you from start to finish, I just wanted to leave this one so that you can see the process. Hello, Marilyn. Hello, Pittsburgh. Hey, North Carolina. Hey, Denise says I hate weeding. Yes. Yeah. Especially sign vinyl. I feel like if you make one little mistake, it's stuck to itself and it's not as forgiving as a heat transfer vinyl. Okay, almost done. Are you? I am. <laughs> hey, Michigan. Southern California. Are you putting up the, her, her vote was to have switch. the light switch in this room. Um, Daddy said no, so I decided <laughs> to put on that light switch 
Which the light up there that that goes to yeah. is out. Yes, Cliff, yes. So. Okay. We've got to fix that light. And then we've got to fix the other and light. And I that thought all these little dots stayed in there, but I guess not. I don't think so. No? Okay. Well, if you start picking them, they're going to come out. No, no, they do. I just, I thought that for the design, I thought they stayed, but I guess they don't because no. how the design is showing is not. This is a much easier way to do it, having a lint roller right here. You just kind of stab the lint roller with your weeding tool and the vinyl comes off and sticks on. So, a great tip from one of our viewers, oh, my, one of our customers. My finger is the switch right now. Is there anything that everyone else has been decorating in their house? Or doing any kind of renovations or using sign vinyl on? We're decorating my bakery playhouse all the way in the backyard. Yes, that has been our uh, quarantine mission. Our quarantine renovation <laughs> has been to change our old shed into a playhouse. Mm -hmm. Well, bakery, which we successfully no did. No spider webs, no nothing. <laughs> no. The most important thing is no spider webs? Yeah, sheds are very, 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 like a thousand times. Hello, Indiana. Robin says, ready to do my fireplace. What are you going to do to your fireplace? Do you know how to make Barbie ones? <laughs> your Barbies. I'm uh, sorry, they need a fireplace. Barbies can't get too close to a fireplace. They melt. Alright, here's one thing. They have fireplaces for Barbies. Sorry, this is taking a really long time. Please yeah, be patient. Yeah, just talk about anything. Okay, for those who are just now checking in, we are doing light switch thingies. We're doing wall plates, vinyls wall plate, for wall things. plates. Cliff says, I placed some vinyl on outdoor light fixtures. Ooh. Nice. How they come out? That would be nice. Such great ideas. Like, it's you know, what, what somebody else does, you never think of. Also be so doing decorate something. my fireplace looking for a great saying. Home sweet home. That's home is where the hearth is. Daddy's oh. <laughs> 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 witty today. <laughs> now, we can also do this, like the middle of the butterfly. No, we're going to do that. We are, yeah. All right. Oh, I'm finally done. Yay. 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 All right. So now I'm going to go ahead and take my tape. And this is the, I did the Oracle tape. And you just cut a piece the size that you need. I think this will do it. Can you open this one for me? Yep. All right, and you're just gonna place this. Actually, sorry, I'm gonna take this off because I don't want that to stick on there. You want the nails off too? Out too. Are the nails in there? Are the screws in there? Screws. See? All of them come with some. Oh yeah, I don't need those. Okay, now I can have my tape that just rolled up on itself. Perfect. <laughs> and a new piece of tape. What do you mean rolled off by itself? It rolled up on itself. It curled all up. You got a she shed. <laughs> I'm jealous. She shed. My, my man shed turned into a playhouse. <laughs> so I'm a little, a little disappointed in that, but it's okay. I'll get it back eventually. Okay. Um, if you could zoom in, I just want to show. This happens sometimes when you're doing sign vinyl. See how there's the paper peels off of here? 
That's because my cut setting was too, too much. It's not a big deal. And I'm just going to take, I just want to make sure I get the rest of these up and then I'll show you how to fix it. Yeah, a lot of my, okay, so before, and I'm going to move this away because it's super sticky. That looks weird. All right, before I go and take this to my wall plate, I have to get all these white, all the white paper off, and you just peel it off. Basically, it's just the paper carrier sheet that you I cut too deep so it cut through my vinyl and the first layer of paper so I just had to go in and get all that paper off first or this part won't stick to my wall plate and the, the way to get around that to avoid this from happening um, to your project is just to adjust the cut depth Outside, our dog needs to let everybody know. He sounds way more ferocious than he really is. Hey, Nana. Hi. Nana's chiming in here. Okay. He picked me. I did not pick him, but I also did pick him. Oh no. So we we picked each other. Okay. Now we are officially. And now we can put it on here. Yes. Wait till the revealing, everybody. Where's that little piece of paper? Hold on. Well, maybe that's on the other side. That's okay. We'll work with it. All right. Thank you. Thank you. And we are just going to go right here. Because I left. I know. That's okay. I left not quite enough space for my... But that's for the okay. hole there, but that's okay. I just said that. <laughs> Diane said her dogs heard our dog barking, so they ran outside barking. Oh, yes, no! <laughs> <laughs> oh you know what? I didn't take into account um, the, screw, the screw spots, but oh well. The, All right. the screws will hit it. They'll puncture through. Yeah. yeah. Okay. And you just kind of wrap it around where you want. This, this could also help. With scissors. Mm -hmm. Okay. So you know not dangerous scissors. And we'll go from this side. Get down. JJ. Thank you. <laughs> Just giving you some sound effects. I guess I didn't know. Push it down hard enough. Uh, Tina says, are some images easier to fit than others? Well, this one was actually, I got this design off um, Design Bundles. I knew that they've been watching. Uh, I kind of mention that one often. But this one was actually a full flower that I just cropped and cut to be the size I wanted. This one is not working. But you can see the other, the other ones that we're going to do... Um, we're going to do a butterfly. That one was also cut to go around the little socket part, but I will show you that as well. And then the... So this is the wrong light switch, but the middle is going to be the switch. And that's, yeah, we'll do that one right go. now. Okay. But that's done. There you go. I think it looks awesome. Joanne say it looks so difficult. It's not. Oh, no. We're, it's just the paper stay, was being stubborn. Stay tuned with the other ones. These other ones, it's it's much easier. Hey, hey, oh, you're going to do that one? Okay. Here, while she's opening that, I'll do another, a little flower. It doesn't take that long to open. Uh, so you Cliff just, says, do you have templates for the switches? No. Um, I made these templates in... Um, while I was in creative studio, just basically I, I measured the whole size and then the Sorry. center. What do I do? Just take this off. Oh, hold on for that for a real quick second. I'm just gonna do. We'll do another flower one just so you can see how easy it is from start to finish. Wait, that's so the same flower. Yep. 
You have you have your design here. Where's my weaning tool? Oh, in case you didn't see it last time. All right, so another little design. Yes. You can't see it, Mom. It's the rose gold placed on the edge. Yes. Okay, so from start to finish, it's super easy. It's just that the design was intricate. If you're not working with that intricate of a design, it won't take that long. Which room is this going in? I don't know. That might go in our art room. Okay, so done. And then I need a little piece of tape. Actually, I'm going to use the same tape that I had before because you can reuse as long as it's still sticky, which it is. Daddy, what do you think? She's already trying yeah, to I, decorate with the yeah. light switch wall plate here. And so there it cut, does it again. My cut depth was way too much for this rose gold, which is fine. This one actually peels off pretty easy. It looks good enough in there. Yeah. Yeah, it doesn't really match with the pink color. But. Okay, that's all right. Well, good thing that plate is white, so it'll go. Okay, so see? Done. It's on your finger. It is, okay. Reflective or glow would be awesome. Yes. They, we do have glow in the dark. What? I guess I have glow in the dark stars. They all fell and they didn't okay. have glow in the dark anyways. And this one was for this. And here. You just place it where you'd like it. We'll do right here. Push on it and peel it up. Whoops. <laughs> I know. I tried to get away with not doing that. But I guess I can't. You can't, because it's so very stubborn. So is that one. Oh, goodness. <laughs> there we go. That was Done. enough. See, <gasps> really easy. Not nearly as long as it took to weed the other one. All right, now we can go ahead. I'm trying to get it nuts. Let's do the butterfly one. Mine is the shooting stars, because I am a shooting star. Okay. You really wearing that pink hair right now? What? <laughs> yes. Oh, my I gosh. I wear every day now. All right, let's see if I... What have we done? Pretty... You have done nothing. Pretty what pretty vinyl pretty. did you use again? This is the... Caesar uh, PSV Easy or Caesar Easy PSV Sign Vinyl Glitter. Actually, Daddy, you did do something. You let me watch Gems. Oh, I did. I, I I broke you. I'm sorry. Yeah. Okay, and that is on there. Well, that's Ooh. gonna look really fun when you put it on a light switch. Nice. Where you going, kid? What room see. is this going on? It, I don't have plans for any room. <laughs> Very nice. And then we'll just do another. This one was already weeded. You said that one was glitter. That's glitter. And then Yay. this is another glitter here. Mm -hmm. Lovely. Yes. <laughs> I don't think Daddy will let us get away with that. I don't but, think it uh, goes with our Rapunzel picture. It does not match the color of the room. Okay, so we'll just kind of place this where you want it. Again, I did not a lot for the placement of Yay, mine. the screws, but that's okay. The butterfly is not for the man cave. <laughs> that, I mean, that would be fun. What man cave? Although I'm not opposed. <laughs> we don't have a man cave, do we? No, we don't. Daddy has his my, room. My man cave, my room. Oh, I try to make that into my own playroom. Yeah, well, you cannot you, take over. Now you can't since you have a whole shed. Right. Yeah. You can't just take over the whole house, you know. Okay. Hello. Get down there. Perfect. All right, there you go. Some shooting stars. Look at that. That. My shooting stars. 
That would look awesome in a man cave. No! <laughs> this is mine. Mine. So, really simple, really easy. Let me see which ones you got there. Here, we'll put them. This one. Got this one. This one. This one. Sorry if I'm going too fast. This one. one there. So, just get some in pieces, fine vinyl. Wall plates we got from uh, Home Depot, which was good we thought when we were there. We didn't know what we were going nice. to do at first, so we were just wandering around Home Depot. Sometimes that's, that's when it comes that's to you. That's fact right there. Wandering around Home Depot and happened to come upon these light switches, and I thought, why not? And we went to the garden, and there were such tiny gates. They were like up to here. Yeah, she's been looking for little gates for her, for her she shed. Bakery! So, um... Do we have any other questions? No, but what do you guys think should be next? Oh yes, we're always looking for ideas, things that you want to talk about. If you just want to do a QA and a about uh, products that we have, we're up for that as well. Just, you know, let us know, start passing out thoughts, ideas. Um, that way it'll help us kind of plan out the next few weeks that we have. If there is something you guys specifically want done, let us know. Yes. Look where this video of Mommy said, if we don't have anything, we'll just play a game of Clue on here. <laughs> Sublimation on tumblers. Okay. That, uh, I will mark that down. I don't have, don't have a sublimation printer at home, but, uh, we'll figure it out. And we'll get you that video and how to do it have to go get a mug press too <laughs> but that's all right totally possible and lemonade nice tea jars hey and crystal hi <laughs> hello lemonade and iced tea jars mm -hmm. like um sign vinyl on them i've never seen those i guess they're like those big jugs i guess <laughs> fireplace oh, like, yeah, decor <laughs> fireplace decor Putting those wooden signs, if you ever done um, heat transfer vinyl on wood, that's really nice uh, to create for the fireplace designs. Instead of doing like a stencil and paint, you can do heat transfer vinyl right onto a wood surface. Um, anything else? He's not paying attention. I'm sorry. <laughs> Let the anticipation build. I think I'm gonna go around and start decorating the rooms. Please don't do that. <laughs> don't do it. Just don't make do everything what? vinyl. So what are you guys doing during this quarantine? Are you uh, just doing whatever you want? Just doing whatever <laughs> Cliff, you want. <laughs> can you help build vinyl racks? Oh, I actually put all my vinyl racks up, actually, in the back. Yes. The three one, we broke apart and we hung it up. Yeah. Uh, we space for the three, but... The Valerie says, do you have a video to show how to put vinyl on glass mugs? Hmm. On glass mugs? I have it on glassware. Um, oh, you know what? The, um... I feel like we've done that before. The, one of the Father's Day specials did put etched vinyl on a glass, and I also have one of on a wine, kind of the stemless wine glass where around Christmas time, probably two years ago now. Um, but I do have other yeah, other glass at home. I have more stemless wine glasses, so we can definitely do an episode um, showing you how to put that onto the stemless wine glass and I believe we have a mug back there that we can do so yes we will do that I have to start writing these down so I don't forget any other ideas come on throw them out <laughs> dog figure it out all right well if there's nothing else as always, you can just message us to let us know um, in the comment section or send us an email so that way we can make sure to include that within our next Facebook Lives. Um, and if you have any other questions, you know, feel free to uh, get in touch with us and we will see you here all next week. 